to you, what does it mean to be a man? Well, I look at it this way. Everything in the in the incarnate universe, everything that's tangible, everything that's here, everything that we can sense has, it, when it's boiled down to its most fundamental building blocks, have a duality to them, mm -hmm. a tick-tock to them. You even think about your heart, systole and diastole. Mm -hmm. Inhalation, exhalation. Mm -hmm. Uh, proton, neutron, mm -hmm. or, or electron, electron, I don't know yeah. which one is. electron, right? Yeah. That's the feminine, negative, yeah. and then the positive. Proton, yeah. Everything's negative and positive. Right. Even the technology that we're talking about, it's a series of zeros and ones, yeah. right? Zeros and ones, that's all this is, digital. That's why they call it digital, digits, two digits. And so the basic fundamental building blocks of everything that not only is physical, but creates potential is negative and positive. And what I mean by that is, of course, technology is because you've got the potential of the negative and the positive working together. A man and a woman, a woman being negative, vagina, empty, man being positive, direct, uh, masculine, erect. Mm -hmm. The ability to create another human being through the negative and the positive of male and female is, a, is really, that's where all of, all of our power comes from. All of our power is sex power. All of our power is sex power. And it doesn't necessarily mean penis and vagina power, but remember before you, were, you and I were talking about uh, parasympathetic and sympathetic. Yep. Sympathetic, parasympathetic. Mm -hmm. So it's this, it's this balance between the masculine and the feminine that allows the world to, to, to be. And so, you know, I, I mentioned before about globalism and this desire to flatten the playing field through egalitarianism, or what I like to say, equalism as a religion, which doesn't exist, it doesn't make sense. We're not equal because if we were equal, we wouldn't have the power of negative and positive. And that there's this agenda to destroy the sexes. And you see it through uh, transgenderism, where they're trying to confuse the children into believing that they don't actually have to identify with <laughs> being a man or a woman. You can be 25 different sexes. And by doing so, by turning men into women, you make them much more ma easily manipulated. Yeah. Good. Because men are, men are by our nature aggressive. We are, we're direct. Mm -hmm. uh, we're not easily swayed. That's why in Genesis, the snake, the serpent, came to Eve, he didn't come to Adam. Because Adam would have been like, get the fuck out of here. Step get on. that snake, get out of here, what are you talking about? You're gonna tell me to, not to obey my father? Not, not not listen to what I'm supposed to be doing? Men, are, men require hierarchy, men require discipline, they require a focus, they require a path. That's just our nature. <laughs>